the magic. The, the Carrick is a space, their goals are just about access to the arts, about openness um, to the arts. That's a mission that I'm, I would want to sign on to. Basically, if you need to do something in town and you need a space to do it in, uh, Laura is kind of the first person that you call uh, because you know that the door is open. My name is Laura Ritchie and I moved to Durham five years ago and started working with another artist on an arts project that became the Carrick, which is a zero commission, donation run, um, volunteer supported art space in the heart of downtown Durham um, that I've been directing since 2011. Um, we noticed that there were many artists in the community uh, who didn't have a whole lot of opportunities readily available to them. And so we just decided to open a space. We give over our space to a new artist or group of artists um, every two weeks. They get complete creative freedom over the presentation of their work. They use the space for free. They keep 100% of what they make from sales. And we look to the community for support. The biggest uh, surprise and the best gain of this whole venture has been this family. I mean, this community, this Durham community of friends and collaborators and peers who I respect a lot. This space has served us so well. I mean, it is gorgeous. It is in the heart of downtown. Artists and visitors love it. I mean, there's like some kind of magic to this space. And I think it's, it's really important that we started here. But as um, downtown Durham in particular uh, explodes and develops, I think a lot of spaces, and the Carrick is probably included in this, are looking to less expensive and um, you know, quieter parts of town for that sort of next generation of, uh, of spaces. There is some concern for us here at the Carrick and for, I think, the, the arts community as a whole about being able to, to stay, to sustain ourselves through this. There's something about the way that development is happening in Durham right now that feels a bit threatening to that um, collaborative, grassroots, like homegrown community, that Durham grit that people talk about. That's where my worry about the development really comes in is, I mean, yes, I am worried about space becoming scarce. I'm worried about space getting expensive. Um, but I'm, I'm worried about the disruption of that spark, of that magic. There are these moments when you can like witness the formation of an idea. You can like see that spark. Um, and it happens in this space all the time.